Hello everyone, welcome back to Neo Kills Gaming. In today's video, we're going to be going over Animal Crossings and the swimming update and everything you need to know about it. First off, anyone can swim, you just need a wetsuit. So if you come over here to Nook's Cranny, you go in the cabinet, and there will be a wetsuit for sale here. There are some other ones that you can get. You can also wear a snorkel, but that is not required. But that's the one that you can buy with bells. If you do not want to spend bells and you'd rather use miles. There are two other ones that you can get over here. So once you come in here, you go ahead and click on redeem nook miles. And if you go all the way over to the novelties, you'll see that you can get the nook ink wetsuit right there as well as a snorkel if you'd like to, but just the wetsuit is required. There is another one that you can get that is in the Nook shopping section under special goods. And right there it is. So once you get one of those three, you will be able to swim. Once you have your wetsuit equipped, make sure you have nothing in your hands, and then you can just go and hit A and enter the water from almost anywhere on your island. If you hit X, you'll see that you cannot interact with a lot of things in your inventory, but you can still access your phone. Here you will have an updated um, list of sea creatures that you can get. There's about 40 in total that you can get, and those can be donated to the museum as well. You do move pretty slow, but if you hold A, you will swim faster, and if you tap A frequently, you will move even quicker. Now, if you see these bubbles, that means you can hit Y and dive underwater, and there you'll is, that's how you'll find your sea creatures. You can also find these scallops, and once a day, you can find Pascal here and he will ask you if he can have your scallop. If you hit sure and give it to him, once a day he will give you a recipe. Now he won't spawn every time you find a scallop, and the scallops can also be donated to the museum. But he will spawn up to once a day just from uh, finding scallops around. And once he swims away here, if you choose to, you can actually follow him or head in the direction that he goes. And then you'll see them swimming outside of your net here. You won't be able to interact with him anymore. But you will see him eat his purchase from you. And that's about all there is for the swimming update. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, let me know down below. And as always, for more on Animal Crossings, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Until next time, everyone, have a good one.